while we're getting um, Woody set up, um, we, I, I was trying to think of how to praise a very long uh, speech about how much Ellen has meant to me, but I wanted to just say that when I first came back from England, I wasn't really in the network yet, in the loop. So um, the music I was listening to was blues and reggae in Cambridge, and I met uh, somebody called Jeff Bartlett, and he had an open mic, he had two, one was bluegrass and the other one was more kind of general singer-songwriter. And it was at that that I m heard Ellen playing with Jake, and I felt this great sense of relief because I wasn't doing too well trying to sing blues. I certainly wasn't doing well singing reggae. And I went, oh yeah, this is more like what I like to sing. So that was the beginning of it, and it's led through, um, you know, by the time I moved to Lowell and then finding out where Concord was so that I could go to Concord to the Emerson umbrella and then following Ellen's open mic as it traveled and then meeting so many wonderful performers, one of whom is standing next to me. And um, even running an open mic for a few years on my own, mentally thinking, well, thank goodness I've been to open mics with Ellen hosting because I know how it's supposed to be done. So the song that I picked, <clears throat> Woody reminded me is the song that we, one of the songs we were going to do in that one feature that we had in Lexington, only someone else sang it. So, so I'm glad I'm first in case anyone has thought of this one. Okay. <laughs> Be 